All right, this is Calibos, and we're playing Minecraft, and it's Skybees. Um, so, let's see. When last we left off, we were doing stuff and things, and I don't remember what any of those were. Uh, yeah, that. Oh, God. Sign. Uh... So we've got those. I wanted to do something with those, but I don't remember what it was. Um, no, we wanted a... Oh, it's see-through. Nice. Um, tuned, alter, and we wanted astral relays. So my question is, so I know that those have to be at a distance uh, from each other, and I can't remember if it's worthwhile to have them at the diagonals as well. Um, star metal, ruined marble for... Marble. Uh, star metal. I just want one. Uh, attunement. Let's get rid of that. Up there. Rock crystal. Two aquamer. Rock. Cool. My gosh, people. Tunement altar. We can do this. Oh, we need another star metal. Do that. Okay, now watch this magic trick. See this sign I put here? I mean, we've pretty much ran face first into the sign. So let's grab some lapis really quick. Pop that down. We go lapis. Watch it change. And then boom, watch the magic ritual happen. Time flies when you're having fun. And night time. God, I hate those things. Why are there even phantoms at all? Those. All right, we've got an attunement altar. Was that a quest? I didn't even know that was a quest. Uh, attunement altar. Okay, sweet. So let's look at this. Attunement. Uh, 
Uh, blah, 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 blah. Structures, attunement, relay. Uh, while well, using full spectrum starlight is useful for general crafting, filtering and limiting the starlight to one specific constellation is far more effective for certain focused uses. A good sorcerer understands well the value of focusing a magical effect from a specific constellation and leveraging this into specialized crafting is a key component to unlocking further advancement in studies at the academy. Any structure capable of filtering extraneous... Fine. Whatever. Uh, better? You can all die now. Um, we need to cover a large area. The absorptive properties of city marble prove is exceptionally useful at trapping the undesired starlight and keeping it away from the desired magical pattern. Using astral relays directly on the pseudo marble allows the chosen resonance to be pulled back out of the marble without risking losses through conventional redirection with marble. Altar block itself may serve as the relay for this purpose. We just did that. Using an array of relays to mimic the appearance of a constellation serves to latch its magical pattern, allowing the central focus to attune an item on top of it to the constellation's magical frequency. The concentrated energy stored in the large city base during nighttime will react when present, presented with a held constellation paper showing the correct placement of the relays for the constellation on the paper. So we need that. So four runed, 80 arch, 225. Let's just get all that going. Ruined. One more. Arch. Uh, Twenty-eight. So eighty is gonna be what? Fifty-two more? Oh, I just I could just do this, and I don't know what I'm doing. Fifty-two. Go. Man, this was hard. Uh, we need how? Uh, 225 sooty. Marble. Um, so we need to craft. We've got five. So, 220 minus 2. Uh, I can math. I, I probably can't math. So, this is 231. We need to take out everything but 6. Okay, next on our list becomes 12 marble pillars and 4 chiseled. Twelve uh, chiseled. Okay, I'm just going to throw the extra 3 off the edge because I feel like it. Okay, so now all we have to do is build it. So I understand that this is going to get bigger. I don't think it's going to get a lot bigger, but I think it's going to get bigger. So we're just going to rod of stuff and things, get rid of that nonsense, get rid of that, that. Uh, we should keep that so let's grab our dirt stick uh, get our 
magical, whatchamacallit. Let's grab some torches. And I, I, I remember that Astral Sorcery takes a lot. I will be the first to tell you that I am not super comfortable with Astral Sorcery. I know that it can do a lot, uh, but it is not, not a mod that I have a lot of practice with yet. Um, and it didn't help that some of the stuff that it... Um, Uh, some of the stuff has changed in it. Um, so, like, for the most part, I, I barely use Astral Sorcery. I'm just gonna start here. Uh, looking at our book. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't even know. Um, it just seemed like ridiculously big. And I still have to do like the the Gaia fight thing arena stuff, and let's go this way and hope for the best, I guess. Doesn't want to fight the Gaia Guardian. You get the fancy fight music, right? That's cool. Um, so I know that each sigil will need like constellation paper or something, too. Uh, I think I can make constellation paper. I, s I saw a recipe for it. Uh, I'm pretty sure that it is within the realms of things that we can craft. Although not within the realm of things that we can auto-craft. That is one of the other reasons that I would tend to avoid. You know, if it's 25... Basic math says that these have to be 15 by 15, so 17, 18. random flower here. I don't know. So, yeah, it's got to be a 15 by 15, right? So we'll do it here. Uh, one, two, four, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Means on a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That'll be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. Uh, four, five, six, seven. Actually, just take the wand. Not do that. Holy God. Uh, that is a lot of dirt that just happened. Just pretend it didn't happen. Uh, one 
saw anything. That mean my inventory is filled with dirt. Like a garbage can thing that used to be here. You know what I should have done? I should have marked the middle. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Five, six, seven. Oh, I did mark the middle. I am amazing. Sweet, we have the thing. Uh, so would be purchase. say I do like this feature I mean it's not the only mod that that has this feature but super handy if you're gonna force people to build pointlessly big giant things then might as well uh Got to get like a mega torch or something so they don't spawn. Okay, so that is okay. So we can just toss a torch in there, and then that's going to require one of those. Okay, now it's going to require pillars. Oh, there's even like a progress bar on the top. I hadn't realized that before. I wonder, yeah, it must have been there before, and I just didn't see it. Another pillar.
so once we get so these should be like the last couple of blocks that's not what I really Right. Done. Uh sparkly. Look at our book. We're, we're probably actually going to need a bunch of these astral relays. I think that's what it says. Uh, when the relays... Yeah, so let's make a couple more relays. Oh, what do we need for astral relays? Uh, get rid of that. Astral relay... So... Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Let's grab green stack glass grab sixteen make some play so it with our whacking stick. Um, then relay, we'll need wood, uh, marble, and whatever. So, marble. That, that, wood. Uh, I don't think it cares what kind of planks. Uh, so we need 32. We need some gold nuggets. Probably also 32. Play. Okay, so now we need a scroll, a constellation paper. So iridescent altar, which altar is this? Celestial altar. Uh, iridescent. Or I'll, I'll, I'll turn. Okay, I'll learn how to spell iridescent. So the next one up. So we can actually do this. Let's make another glass lens really quick. Uh, glass lens. Grab some aquamarines. Uh, So, so we need glass lens, uh, a celestial crystal. So we'll need resonating gems. So we'll need a starlight infuser. Gosh. Starlight. Gen. 
Okay, so four gold. We'll need a bucket of white goo. Bucket. So we'll need two aquamarines, six pillars, and a star metal. Star metal. Aqua, aquamarine, aqua. Oh man, we are at 26 minutes. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, call it here, and we'll pick this up in the next episode. Four gold, three ruined. Gold. Um, so yeah, I hope you like this episode. We've made a little bit of progress, sort of, rabbit holing stuff as usual. Um, at least the rabbit hole this time is pretty much limiting itself to one mod. But you know how it is. But yeah, I hope you folks have a fantastic day. You know the things to do if you liked it, etc., so on and so forth. Catch you later.